nobody, nobody believe I learned my lessons, lessons, so I'll stay around nobody. I can never trust nobody, nobody. I'll stay around. What's good, everybody? It's your boy Uncle Sam's Reject, and today we're here for a Throwback Thursday pack opening of the Toronto Raptors and the Charlotte Hornets. Let's get into it, baby. First pack here. We don't get any emeralds, any sapphire, all gold. We don't even end up getting a player from the pack. So sad. Second pack here. Maybe we can get a little bit more lucky, and we do not. We get a coach as our goal. Coming up here on the third pack finally we get a player from the historic pack sunny wings finally on the board trying to complete these collections here and we get another sunny wings hopefully he's selling pretty well on the market right now in the auctions but uh we really don't need that many of them but we finally get an emerald and it's chris bosh had him plenty of times already but he definitely could give you a couple thousand still here we are opening up our topper and it's Walt Williams. I don't know if a lot of y'all remember Walt Williams, but he definitely could pop that thing from three. And we get a Matt Geiger. That was, <laughs> I remember he used to play for the Sixers, man. People thought he was like the greatest center ever. And we get a Matt Bonner, one of the whitest dudes ever in the NBA. I think Scalabrini's got him beat, though. Scalabrini's my boy. But we do end up getting another Emerald here. And finally, we get the young ball, T-Mac. Everybody's been trying to get that card, man, and we got him. We actually got him a lot during this pack opening, and I tell you what, T-Mac definitely sells well on the market. As we see here, we got our boy Kurt Rambis. Whenever I think about Kurt Rambis, I think about that time he got clotheslined in that Lakers Celtics uh, series. Great times. He's one of the realest white boys ever to play the sport. He got up ready to rock, even though James uh, Worthy was trying to hold him back. Second pack of the evening. This is all from last night, uh, my time here in Germany. I'm a little off from you guys in the U.S., so when I'm opening packs up late at night, it's usually the middle of the day for you guys, so I really don't get a chance to, to post this up. But, yeah, man, I was up till like, 1 in the morning. As you see, we get Boris D out here. I was up till like, 1 in the morning last night opening up packs, man, grinding and trying to finish some of these historic packs. You can see here we got my boy Jalen Rose, and we coming up on our second topper on our second pack, and we get another Jalen Rose back-to-back. -back. But, yeah, man, like I was saying, I was up, I was up till 1 in the morning, and, um... Yeah, man, fucking, you know, I was up, I was up grinding, man, so sometimes I open packs and I don't get a chance to, to get gameplay with them as soon as I get them. I just open the packs, and I have officially completed all regular NBA collections. I'm completely, I got all my rewards from it and everything. So, you know, I, I can only work on historic collections from here on out. So we got my boy Lou Will. Shout out to Drizzy. Um... So, yeah, man, got D. Brown here. But, like, yeah, man, like, at first it started off really, really slow with these packs. And, you know, I was getting a little discouraged, you know, using my VC, Rex Chapman, another another trade ball. But we do have a Sapphire here ready to open it up. Hopefully it's Kendall Gill or somebody like that. That's who I was wishing it was. But come to find out is no other than Steph Curry. But, for he first, he does still sell well on the market, but... Amidst opening all these packs, we did end up getting a My Team Reward. My first Amethyst here, 2K17, Michael Ray Richardson. Now, he's not, you know, like the greatest scorer out of Amethyst point guards, but he's a true point guard. He gets to the rack, he gets fouled, he makes plays, but he's just not going to stroke a lot of threes from downtown. But we finally get our first Ruby, first pack of this, first, first pack of this box, our, our topper, Muggsy Bowes, ladies and gentlemen, that this dude Muggsy is going for quite a bit on the um, on the oxygen screen right now. As you see, we come up here, come up on another Sapphire, and he's a part of the pack. Antonio Davis, ladies and gentlemen, from the Toronto Raptors. I definitely think he should be in that Pacers pack though, because he was he was my boy. And so as you see here, we need one more card to complete this collection. My boy Kendall Gill, we add him to the collection. We already finished the Hawks collection. Mrs. Shaq on the Heat. But we're going to go ahead and grab our reward, no other than a diamond LJ. Larry Johnson, ladies and gentlemen, Grandmama himself. He was my boy back in the day when I was a kid, man. Love the way this dude played. Love the way they played at, at UNLV and everything. 
But, like, I remember even when he had the back spasms and was old as hell on the Knicks, he was still putting in work, man. But this dude is definitely one of the one of the best power forwards. I'm, I'm not necessarily going to say ever, but definitely one of the best that I have seen play in my 27 years of living. Um, you see here, let's go take a, a quick look over his stats. 6'7", 257, 29 years old at this point from UNLV. But you see his work in the post. He is an absolute monster, and he demands respect down there. He is a grown man, as you know. He, he gets down there and bangs with the best of them, even though he's not the tallest. But you see his driving dunk, standing dunk. He will be catching a couple bodies and for a big dude, 95 stamina. Now here we are looking at the amethyst, Michael Ray Richardson, 6'5 PG from the New York Knicks. 96 overall defensively. Yeah, that was another thing. The dude locks up, man. As you see, his offensive stats are not that great. You know what I'm saying? He's like he's like he's like your grandpa's point guard. You know what I'm saying? Like he's the floor general. He's the coach on the floor. He makes the passes. He makes he makes he sets up other people to make plays, and he locks in on his defenders because there was a lot of good point guards back in the day when he was playing. So you know, it's definitely do you want in your team. But let, here's another update on my roster. As you see here, we have two diamonds and the amethyst in the lineup. Make sure to like if you dig in this video. Subscribe if you're new. Gameplay coming soon later on. I'll let you guys later. Peace. I got so many enemies. Why these niggas want me? Stay high with the good trees.